Okay, so what's up guys and welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel if you're new. So as you guys can see, I'm in my closet, okay, because today we're in quarantine and I'm cleaning out my damn closet because I'm tired of looking at all this stuff. There's literally like, I have backdrops in here, I have all my like bralettes and stuff like that. I have shorts, I have shirts, blah blah blah, obviously. And then over here is like random stuff. So like I have my shoes. That's a trash bag that I'm going to use to put everything in. That's like a laptop case. There's like shoes everywhere. And then these are all like rolled khakis that Anthony never even wears. There's hats. There's some swim trunks and sweats and random stuff. And then up here we have like some ammo because Anthony likes to go to the shooting range. But anyways. Then there's like coins and my purses and stuff like that. And then at the top... There's like a bunch of random stuff all right here. These are all my arts and crafts stuff. There's shoes everywhere. And then this side is Anthony's side. So he has his pants hanging up. He has belts and stuff, which that's actually my belt, but that's not the point. And then he has all these clothes that go all the way back. There's shoes falling everywhere. So my goal for today is just to get this closet back in order how it's supposed to be and get it back cute and I want to move all of my summer clothes to the front of the closet because now that it's starting to get hot I don't want to have to dig all the way through my closet just to find like tank tops and stuff like that so yeah and I'm gonna try to donate a lot because a lot of this I don't even wear like I literally probably wear like three things out of this entire thing um and half of it is from Anthony's side of the closet like the one I'm wearing right now this is his Columbia so thanks but anyways, so let's get started, guys. Okay, so hopefully this lighting is okay. Um, I literally just changed these light bulbs to daylight ones because it was the yellowish shit in here. And I don't have any light in here because this is a deep... It's not a deep closet, but it's, like, not the best. If the, okay, anyways. So this entire side over here is all mine. This is all of Anthony's, which for those of you who don't know if you're new here, Anthony's my boyfriend, okay? So... All of these are his clothes. He works more than he does anything else. So half of this is work clothes. So if there's paint all over stuff. No, he's not dirty. He's a hardworking man, okay? I have a trash bag that I'm just gonna have over here somewhere so that I can just throw stuff in there. First things first is I have these backdrops in here that I literally don't even use. So I think I'm gonna fold them and probably put them like in the garage or maybe put them like in a container somewhere that's not hanging up right here because these things are thick or I might just put them like in the back of my closet I really don't know but I want to keep them because whenever I actually get my studio back whenever I get it back I'm actually probably going to be using those a lot okay so I have these shorts I literally never wear them I don't like how they make my body look they make my legs look like toothpicks so, we're going to donate these. Okay, I have a Dallas Cowboy shirt. We're keeping that. This one, I cut into a crop top, and I actually used to wear it a lot, but I think I've worn it a little too much. So, we're going to donate this shirt. I think I'm going to donate. I literally never wear it. This is a Brandy Melville shirt, too, but I never wear it. I don't know why. Don't want that. This one, it says Girl Power. I actually love this shirt. This one right here, oh my god, this is so cute. It's like a mesh shirt. I wore this to Jambalaya. And I wore like a neon um, bathing suit top, technically. But it kind of looked like a, um, like a bandeau type thing. But it's cute as hell, okay? So I'm keeping that. Okay, I don't wear these shorts. These used to be pants, and I actually cut them off. I used to do that, like, to all of my shorts, pretty much. Like, every uh, summer, I would cut off all my pants and make them into shorts. Cardigans, I literally don't wear cardigans anymore. So, I'm getting rid of all of these. This is a cute-ass sweater. Look at this sweater. It's open. Like, this is the back of it, and it's completely ripped all the way down. Oh! It's not warm at all, but it's really cute. I love this thing so much. So we're keeping that. This is a cardigan, but it's for work, so I'm going to keep that. This is a Pink Floyd shirt. We're keeping that. 
I actually wear sweaters quite a bit, but my style is kind of changing. So I don't know if I want to keep it. No, I'm going to get rid of it. Okay. Oh, I love this shirt. This is a Polaroid shirt. And this was thrifted. I think I got it for like a few bucks. Maybe like $5 or something. But it's so cute. I love it. And then the next time I went, I seen a jacket. And it was kind of like a windbreaker. And it said Polaroid all over it. And it was so fucking cute. I wish I would have bought it. But my excuse for throwing away all these clothes is that I can buy more. That are cuter. So Laura's Boutique, here I come. This is my Columbia jacket that I should be wearing, but I'm not going to because Anthony's is more comfortable. <laughs> this is a Brandy Melville sweater, but I'm just going to, I've worn it so many freaking times. And I literally think I've had that since high school. So we're just going to get rid of that. This is one of my favorite jean jackets and it's thrifted and I got it for like $15, I think. And normally a jean jacket of this size, like this is like an oversized one, obviously. And you you can find them for like 40-ish dollars, like 30, 40. I got mine for 15 at a thrift store. Oh, this one I just bought. This is a crop top. Um, it's just a t-shirt, but it's a crop top. $5 at Target. Go get you one. $5. This one was a Christmas present from Anthony. Why am I telling you guys like a story behind each piece of clothing like my clothes actually mean something to me and all of these wow i'm actually cleaning out a lot of space i can buy new clothes this shirt i absolutely love it's pink this is one of my favorite colors or it is my favorite color okay getting rid of this purple sweater we'll have this prescott i cannot get rid of this one dallas cowboys all day long you know, Dallas, Texas. This isn't even mine. Whose is this? Is this mine? I mean, it's cute. Okay, so at all my friends, I don't know whose this is. Um, if it's yours, claim it. If not, I'm going to wear it. So, because it's actually really cute. What size is it? The medium? Oh, yeah, I will be wearing this. So, if it's not, if you don't claim it, it's mine. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna donate this one. This is just a tank top that I never wear because it's see-through. Wow. I can actually move my clothes now. <laughs> I literally have an entire bag of clothes to donate and I still have to go through Anthony's side of the closet. Okay, so really quick, I'm going to organize my clothes from like tank tops to t-shirts to like pants and you, you know what I'm saying. So yeah, okay, let's get it going. Okay guys, so I got rid of a lot. Like look. Once upon a time, there was something on each of these hangers, like literally like two weeks ago. But so I organized it by, I have my tank tops, I have all my crop tops, um, I have like my shirts that are like not like regular t-shirts, but they're just like, I don't know how to explain it. Like this is a onesie and then this is like a really like good material tank top type thing. Um, I have all my shorts, my pants are hung up on these little thingies to save space. Then I have my t-shirts, I have my work shirts, I have my long sleeves, I have my dresses and jumpers, um, and then it goes into all like my jackets and sweaters and stuff, which aren't really like too organized, but it's like all my winter stuff back here. And then I still have my cheer things right here, and then back here is just like all of my scarves. So I feel like I got rid of quite a bit. Um, now it is time to attack this whole thing right here he has a lot of clothes that he honestly does not wear like all of these khakis right here he does not wear he has like like who you don't need this dude it's not even cute i don't i just i i just don't understand but um he does have a, like a lot of work clothes and stuff like that so i think i'm just gonna probably do like a little time lapse of me doing his clothes so that way this video isn't like freaking forever long because I know it's already probably kind of long. 
Um, so yeah, let's get into it. I need some sweet tea, goddammit. Maybe even younger, because I met him when he was 15. He's had this for a long ass time and he refuses to get rid of it. Okay, so now I feel like it's a lot better on the hanging portions. I still have to go through like all of this stuff, which I probably am gonna film, but I don't know if I'm gonna actually show you guys. Um, I'll probably just show you guys like the, uh, ooh, that's not good. Mm, I'll probably just show you guys like the after or something. Um, I don't really know. I might just leave it in a montage because I don't know how long this video is so far. But anyways, so really fast, I separated all of his clothes. So these are all of like the empty hangers, obviously. He has his pants, or his khakis and then his pants. Tank tops, workout shirts, all his work shirts go all the way back to like somewhere in here. Uh, to like somewhere in there. And then their back is all his like regular t-shirts then it goes into like his jackets all of his jerseys which this boy has so many i had no idea he had that many and then his polos and his um like collared shirts or button downs and stuff and then back there in the very very back i have like an old halloween costume and then i have my old prom dress so yeah this whole bag right here is trash like not even donate it's like trash because his work shirts were like can we please just take a second and look at my damn nose ring this is one of the little hoopty hoop little stud swirly type nose rings and they suck don't ever get them if you get your nose pierced because mine anytime i barely grab it this is what it does so i'm sorry you guys have to look at that but anyway so let's continue bad for those of you who don't know he is a painter so he whenever he works he gets really freaking dirty um, and then he just re-wears the same shirt, so like pain just builds and builds and builds and builds. So I have to make the executive decision to throw all that shit away, because, yeah, I feel a lot better. It looks a lot better in here already. I just need to like tidy it up a little bit and then, um, clean out like the top. I really want to get like a storage bin and put all the crafts and stuff in there so it's not in literally an old boot box. But I don't know when that's going to happen because of this whole quarantine thing. I might see if I can order some on Amazon. But yeah, so right now I'm about to go through his pants down here at the bottom. And I'm probably going to donate all his khakis. Oh, I even completely forgot to tell you guys. If you haven't noticed already, I cut my hair all off. Like yesterday, I just chopped it all off. Okay, so I'm donating all of these so right now I have all of like my electronics boxes in here or like so this is like a Nixon watch my camera an Apple TV Apple watch iPhones um, airpods like Apple pencil like literally anything Apple products or like for my camera is all in this thing and I think I'm gonna put these in like a bag and then I'm gonna put all my arts and crafts in here and put it on that empty shelf right there okay guys I finally finished um I didn't really film that much of the last part because it wasn't really like I didn't really know what I was gonna do I kind of just you know I was messing around and moved a little things moved a few little things around but anyways I'm about to show you guys what it looks like. I didn't even touch my shoes, so they're all jacked up, so don't even pay attention to those. But I will show you guys what it actually looks like now. So. Okay, 
Okay, so that is what she looks like now. Um, up here, all in this area used to be where those um, boxes were and this little um, blue thing right here. That's where this was, but now it has all of my arts and crafts stuff in it. So during quarantine when I'm bored, I now can look at everything and see what I want to play with. Because your girl is really crafty and I get bored really easy. Obviously, that's why I'm cleaning up my damn closet. But anyways... So yeah, I think it looks pretty good. I I mean, obviously it's not exactly how I would want it to be. Um, eventually I want to go through and I want to change all my hangers so that they all match and so that they're not the thick ones. I want to get like the thin ones. We are donating. This entire bag is donation and then this bag is trash because it has like his old beat up shirts that nobody wants and it has like that box in it and stuff. But all of this is to do or... That entire bag is what we're going to donate. Um, so yeah, I'm very, very happy. Now I get to buy more clothes. <laughs> Who doesn't want to do that, right? But anyways, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed cleaning out my closet with me. Um, I didn't think people would want to watch uh, a, a video like this, but I've been seeing a lot of people post it. And my friends are telling me that they would definitely watch it. So hopefully you guys enjoyed it. My next video, I'm actually going to be doing a makeup challenge video which is very very interesting my friend alexis and i came up with it and yeah i'm super excited about that one it's i'm probably gonna film it tomorrow so make sure you subscribe turn on your post notifications so that way you can check that out and yeah happy quarantining guys and i will see you guys in my next video bye guys